so we have already understood what is product what is product price book price book entry and the relationship between them let's understand it more details with the help of the example so like for example uh, let's set up a product so if i go to a product let's create a new one let's name it samsung tv we need to make the product active and then choose the product family so i put hardware and then these things we will see later and then i save it so a product is being created this is the product which i want to sell now i go to related once i go to related i see a price book here i'll select on add standard price book so here i will say okay the price book is like for us dollars maybe 500 and i click on save so you see a standard price book is created which is active now for example it is uh, sold in different countries so initially there is only one price price that is standard price but if it is sold in different countries then we have to create multiple price books so for example it is sold in another country so like INR so I, I will be choosing INR for setting up currency we have to like set up multiple currencies so that we will do later so for now um, we will just put it as USG now here uh, for example I want to put price as 30,000 and save so you can see that we have uh, uh, this Samsung product for this price is 500 in US and in INR it is like 30,000 like uh, if we manage the currency then it will be coming in rupees so that's how the price book works now we have like if you observe when I did the add to price book and I selected like Canada or USG and clicked on next price book entry got created because this is a junction object which is linked to product and price book so that's get created where one is like standard one and if I and I, I choose it is not a standard price book so that's how the product and price book gets created so that's how it is being attached so now like um, as a customer uh, we have created product and then price book now let's see how exactly it works so like a customer wants to purchase samsung tv so we go to opportunities in the opportunities like let's take any one of them so i choose a particular opportunity and in that opportunity you can see a quote is being added let's add our own quote so let's delete it um like i will create a new quote and here i will be selecting that particular opportunity which which i have to link the quote and then this is quote means like we discussed right it's uh invoice like rough invoice which we are wanting to send to the customer so we choose that we can choose that uh, uh, like account that particular primary contact and then uh, we can choose the address as well this we can do later i'm just showing exactly how it works the whole scenario and we click on save so the quotes gets generated and once the quote is being uh, created we go to something like make it like primary for this particular opportunity so if i make it primary what happens is if i click on an opportunity you can see that this particular quote will be coming now the quote is being regenerated i'm just showing you steps with the example you will later learn more better way i click on edit lines what happens in edit line we need to add the product to that particular quote so i click on add product and uh, let's see samsung tv and click on select and we say select so whatever the list of products are there that get added so samsung tv here it is being added now for example i want to change the quantity to 10 
so i change the quantity and click on calculate automatically see the number will get calculated if i want to delete other ones we can easily delete them so let's delete them let's focus on this one and this is how we will be able to see amount and then if you want to give like additional discount we can simply add the discount here so like that we can add things once we have done that we can even like select on add product we can select on uh, more products here so if you select more product more product will get added here like that you can update it then you can also like click on like add group group is like you want we can discuss in more detail but for example samsung is like a uh, different category and this is different category so you can create groups uh, we will go that in detail later then we have already seen what is calculate we have seen delete and lines so that's how the the, in the quotes the product gets added so we have added the products right so let's go back to that opportunity you see the products are being added okay so that's so there's a quote and then there's being there's products being added to them if i go to a particular quote you can see that in, if i select a particular quote i have put it as a primary quote there can be only one primary quote per order sorry per opportunity and uh, uh, this uh, opportunity and this related account and primary contact we didn't populate it right but they are coming by its own and these prices are being calculated and coming like that you can also click on like preview document so preview document is like what we have sent to the customer so it will be uh, showing in this way that the customer what they want to see the total price the products they want to purchase and then they can go ahead and check it and sign it so uh, basically it starts from lead account and opportunities get uh, converted to, to get to get converted and then in opportunity we add quote in the quote we add the product in the product we can edit and apply discount and other information and once we do that this is how the structure works uh, in the next video we will be understanding this whole thing with the help of an example uh, which will be more easier for you